Is your macOS photo app acting up? For example, maybe not allowing you to export any of your photos. Let me show you how to quickly fix this. This is a common problem. It causes lots of frustration. People have had this happen at the worst possible moments where they think that their photos are gone forever. Not the case. It's just that the index needs to be fixed on them and let me show you how to do that. It'll just take a couple minutes and have you back up and running again. First thing, close the app. Now we're going to hold down the Option and Command key and reopen the application. It should immediately pop into the Repair Library and we're going to say Continue. After you say Continue, you're going to need to either scan your fingerprint or in this case I'm going to enter my password. So after I input my password, it should start repairing the library. The repair time is going to depend on how many photos you have. My library has around 20,000 photos and about 1,500 videos and took about 10 minutes to repair. It will depend on how much is on your computer, how fast your computer is. Mine's a MacBook Pro, so it may be a little faster than most, but it should be fixed in about 10-15 minutes. Hopefully this then gets us back here where we can open up the library and are able to view and export our videos once again. This is back to normal operation. Hopefully now we have your Photos application working properly again and you're able to perform all the functions. What may be going through your head right now is why did this happen and how do I prevent this in the future? There are two main ways that you can get your uh, database corrupted and the two ways are going to be uh, low disk space is, is the number one. So make sure that you have plenty of disk space available when you're doing your imports. If you're constantly battling the uh, low disk space, it may be uh, time to get an external drive and archive some stuff off, or you may need to upgrade your uh, internal storage on your uh, laptop or desktop to, to accommodate that. But that is one of the main region, reasons that this happens. The other reason it happens is around the operations not completing. So in the case of me, I have a, a Sony camera and I'm shooting my photos in both RAW and JPEG format. What that means is I am importing a lower res and a higher res at the same time. So when my imports run, the process after the import is taking longer to index and line those images up and to bring them in. If you then do the import, at the moment that it says it's done complete, you shut the lid on your laptop, you run the risk of uh, corrupting your database because it still has some work to do in the background to go through the photos and to index them and to put them into the right locations, as well as logging into the database what these images are about and the metadata around them. So that is one of the major causes that can that could cause this. So one, keep your disk uh, uh, clean. You might want to use a uh, product like Clean My Mac. Uh, they are not a sponsor. I'm not endorsing them, but it is a, a product that uh, does do a good job at helping clean up background system files and everything on your Mac, as well as making sure that you have a little bit of patience after the import process runs and that you allow those processes to complete before putting your computer to sleep or shutting the lid on it. Be sure to hit the like, subscribe, and notification buttons here on this video to keep informed about upcoming tech tips.